Sierra Gunter. I was born November 22nd, 1994. My mom's name is Jemira Taylor and my father's name is Larry Gunter. My mom was born and raised in Detroit, Michigan and my dad was born and raised in South Carolina. I interviewed my great aunt, a beautiful woman who had a huge influence in my mom's life. I was born in, uh, in March, as a matter of fact, March 23rd, 1944, as a preemie, a twin. I survived. My twin sister did not survive. Uh, I stayed with my mom, Karuka Buford, and my dad, William Buford, up until 1960s in the 1960s. Growing up, my mom never really gave me a specific role to play as a girl. But because of my disability as being visually impaired, now totally blind, my mom taught me the importance of being independent and I stress independent because the way the world looks at uh, the visually impaired people it's like we are subnormal in intelligence and in every area of life but my mom pretty much threw me out of the nest, and I've been a survivor. All I saw was her taking care of me and my older sister, along with the help of my grandmother sometimes. Um, really, the main thing I got from my mom growing up is the roles I had to play in this world as a person, period, not specifically a girl. She taught me resilience. She taught me never to give up on something that I start. And she taught me that I could do whatever I wanted to do or whatever I dreamed. As long as I worked hard at it, I could have it. School is Education is important. It helps the mind. Mm -hmm. not, not only just surviving money-wise, but it, it keeps you youthful. It, it keeps you going. It, it, it uh, stimulates the brain. My, when I was younger, my dream was to be famous. <laughs> I just wanted to be an entertainer. I wanted to sing. I wanted to dance. I wanted to act. I wanted to do all of that. And like I said, my mom, she always encouraged me and she always let me know that as long as I worked hard, I could do anything that I put my mind to. And she even told me that college isn't for everybody. If that's not something that I feel like is for me or something that I feel like is going to help me reach my dreams, then that's not something that I have to do. I decided on my own to come to college as a psychology major and further my education and I, I don't regret my decision. I have to learn. I mm -hmm. have to learn. I have to put all of my energies into this. Mm -hmm. And as a consequence, this is the way I talk to my grandchildren and I talk to my children. You got to do your best. You got to put Give it, give it your all and all if you want to succeed in everyday life. And we graduated May 13th, 2017. And I will 
continue to live and continue to learn even after college. I'm an individual, a strong black woman, a woman who's independent, as independent as can be, as I could possibly be, of course, with the help of God. I'm just as important as my other sisters and brothers.